Bobby Bradley, former first round draft pick of the Pittsburgh Pirates. After five surgeries and uh, two herniated discs and nerve damage, now I'm into the sport of long drive golf. And a two time world finalist. I picked up a baseball when I was two years old. I always had uh, the aspirations of being a major leaguer. Started off in T ball when I was five and moved all the way up through the high school ranks. My first full season of pro ball started in 2000 in Carolina with the Hickory Crawdads. After my 10th game, I ended up blowing out my elbow. I had to get Tommy John surgery. Those surgeries added up to having shoulder, two elbows, and by the end of 2005, I had a rib removed, and I also had nerve damage in my hand, which I had to have carpal tunnel surgery. Long drive's a lot of fun. You have about 100 guys in the world at any time that can go out, and if they have a good day, they can win a tournament. All right, we're going for the green right here. The difference between the top one to 100 players in the world is accuracy. And the mouth guard, with my balance and focus and strength and, and just being relaxed at the tee box, I felt that my accuracy has got 100 times better. Oh my god. That ball's killed. First thing I saw was strength. I felt strength. And then they had me do the flexibility test. I went about a foot and a half farther, especially for golf. That really, you know, caught my eye was that when I when I was taking my club back, I would be able to get more of a turn, which would create more speed for me. It is a truly performance-enhancing device. The biggest problem for me was that when I was throwing a baseball or hitting a golf ball, I would always have issues with my neck. Because when you swing a long drive club as hard as you can for 10 hours, I mean, anybody's gonna be sore. But the thing I really noticed was that my neck and my shoulders felt like I never even never even hit. You can't explain what it does for you, but there's a lot of science behind it to prove that when you put this in your mouth, it, it is definitely enhancing your performance. Time to pop in the mouth, Gad. Pure power edge, baby. Wearing the mouth guard, I can get a couple miles per hour more. I try to make it look good there. When you're hitting against the top hitters in the world, every little bit counts. I got into the world championships by eight inches. And for me, being relaxed, balanced, focused, that extra strength, I feel like I can, I can be one of the top 10 hitters in the world and be on TV and be on ESPN and hit for the world championships this year. I have the right equipment, I have the right mindset, and I'm ready to go.